This is Chantal Todé, Senior Editor on Mobile Marketer. So it's really interesting to see Google come out with Eddie Stone and it. So we've now got Google and Apple both behind Beacon Technology, which is great. That means, you know, that that sort of really end, uh, lends a lot of support to Beacon Technology um, and, uh, you know, suggests that it's going to be sort of an ongoing standard uh, and, and marketers, you know, really need to be paying attention. We've certainly seen a lot of interest around it over the past couple of years since Apple introduced Reduced, um, iBeacon, um, but you know Apple hasn't necessarily been as um, supportive of developing this space um, as as Google is saying it wants to be and is is positioning itself to be. So you know with that in mind, Google does really sort of have the the potential to um, sort of take over the leadership role here in Beacons, and and they envision Beacons really sort of impacting consumers. Um, you know, in, in a number of ways throughout the day, and that's why they're sort of putting this out there as this open platform uh, that anybody can can develop for. So, um, you know, I expect we're going to, can we're just going to see a, uh, you know, a deluge of more Beacon-enabled um, opportunities. Um, there could also be some issues with, you know, the Beacons, the actual hardware, and, you know, supporting um, both platforms. So, um, you know, there could be some some um, sort of standard war type stuff going on.